Okay, this is a uh, dynamo cabinet. It was originally a clutch hitter. You can see the front here. It's got uh, two Wicko sticks, three buttons each. Uh, cabinet is in good shape physically. It looks worse than it is in a couple spots, and I'll explain that to you in a moment. Here's the front, all right, painted black. You're going to have a, a hole to fill in there and a hole to fill in down there. You can see they put a bolt and a big washer in there. I guess that's where a locked on bar used to be. Now, coin door is a little bent over here. Not a big deal, though. The keys are there. Here's the coin vault. There's a coin bucket. All right, as you can see, uh, it's probably stored somewhere where it's a little bit moist, has a little bit of corrosion on the metal parts, but the cabinet itself is fine. Have a gouge there. You have some gouges along the uh, the bottom. That noise in the background is my uh, dehumidifier. I keep running. Uh, it comes with the monitor. This is a K7000. K7000 monitor. I just did a little Todd Tucky there. K7000 monitor. Uh, it has a nice picture. I don't have anything to hook it up to to show you. Uh, you'll have to take my word for it. It does have a little bit of burn. You can see it was, um, at one time, it was uh, being used as a vertical monitor. Uh, I really can't tell. It says credit down there. I can't tell what else there is. This isn't uh, tinted. This is clear plexi. You can see you really can't see much burning. On the sides, the wood and everything is in good shape. The vinyl's coming off. You see this vinyl looks melted. Uh, this was left out in, uh, when I first got this cabinet. I unloaded it and I left it out in the sun uh, at the time. I think one of my kids was sick or my wife was sick or something. So I, I left it outside. I forgot about it. Came back out hours later and it had melted some of the vinyl. The vinyl is all kind of gouged up anyway. So um, I always uh, expected to, uh, to put new vinyl on it. You can see here. But again, this wood, no swelling. No water damage, it's in good shape, nothing's broken off. It's just you're gonna need to revinyl it. It's on wheels. Move my kids' stuff out of the way. See if I can get you back here without much effort. Here's the uh oh, you saw that side. Here's the other side of it. Other side's in better condition. Got a kind of a chunk out of it here. Down here. Oh, God. It's a heavy back door. I wish I had a light. Let me get a light. This is the worst video ever, but. I'm trying to do these a little impromptu to move some more stuff out of here. So I apologize for the cam work. Uh, K7000? Yeah, K7000. Alright. Uh, I didn't recap it. Maybe it was recapped at one point in its life. It wasn't me. Looks good though. Bare bones. This is wired for JAMA. It's got an open frame power supply down there. That's what came with it. Uh, that connector was never used when I got it. And uh, you know, just, you know, fuse, line fuse, uh, you know, filter, and uh, isolation transformer. Marquee light works nice and clean on the inside. So, uh, there you go. Any questions, uh, feel free to, to ask.